Well, we've been doing this 20 years. We started out real small in the parking lot way back there. Every year since, Dale Barry says the campsite he sets up in anticipation for Milwaukee County's July 3rd fireworks show has gotten bigger and more impressive. We all, you know, camp out, have a good time. And every year somebody new comes and camps out because they're like, really? You can do that? You can if you're there early enough to rope off a spot. 6 a.m. Saturday morning. Yeah, we had to tape everything out and everything. Otherwise, you don't get a spot. So some have been doing it for decades. About 35 years. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Willie Polanco says he's claimed this territory as his spot for 20 years. Yeah, the same exact spot. So there's people that come, they come walk around and like, hey, it's it's Willie. <laughs> Lisa Lewis is new to the camping game. This is her second year, but she says she's got the keys to success down. Then you want to come super early and you want to start setting up. And then you got to make sure you have everything you need, your grills, your, your water, your refrigerator. We have a refrigerator, we have a generator. And a campsite commode. So this is the bathroom. And what we're going to do is going to put a fan up in here, a little mirror. So and also a scent smell. <laughs> so, so a bathroom and then we have the shower over yeah, here. So the shower is not hooked up yet. She has time to get that hooked up before the fireworks on Monday. Most of the campers there for 40 hours plus before the first firework hits the air. It's not crazy. It's fun. You just got to enjoy your city, you know, and for them to allow us to do this on these days is awesome. Kendall, those are quite the elaborate setups. I, I'm speechless right now. Well, the fireworks show actually <laughs> doesn't start until 930 tomorrow night, though. That's right, Cyria. And if you're not committed to camping out like these guys, you can park close to Veterans Park tomorrow. That'll be $25, but you do want to get here early because as soon as those lots are full, uh, Lincoln Memorial Drive will close until the fireworks show ends. Quite the party already down at Veterans Park on the lakefront. Thank you, Kendall Keys, reporting for us live.